It was fun while it lasted. Look at this eerily familiar setup. <laughs> It's amazing. No matter what courtroom we're in, they're all kind of built the same way. Yeah, we always got the two dudes standing at the door. Hmm. A couch. Window. It's always the same. All right, we got 15 minutes to figure this out. Hehehe. <laughs> 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 True. There's nobody really. Really not a single person anywhere. Willy Wonka. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> no, no, it's not Willy Wonka. God, he looks horrifying. We literally just got here, and now we have to defend a man. <laughs> it's been a weird day. It has. <laughs> <laughs> Holy smokes. Oh my god! <laughs> it's weird when it's not in 3D. It is weird. I still recoiled though. Even though it wasn't 3D, I was just like, ah. I recoiled not because I thought it was going to come out and hit me in the face, but the opposite. I knew it wasn't going to, but it was still jarring. Is he going to defend himself anyway? <laughs> Does he seem like the type to make it all up? <laughs> right? Sorry, we're new here. We've only been here for like a couple hours at most. The name is filled in. 
there no longer be. question marks. <laughs> now this is a person with a face. Yes, a very terrifying face and weird shoulders, mostly because he doesn't have a neck. Quite <laughs> angular. Quite angular, yes. I don't know, man. <laughs> yeah, now that we can get a word in edgewise. Um, mm -hmm. Get a word in edgewise. <laughs> I had that thought too as I said it. <laughs> Oh dear, he's he's gone all Sir, we would never think that. <laughs> uh, no. You are innocent until proven guilty, not the other way around. I mean, these games would lead you to believe otherwise. They sure would. I was about to say, unlike in these games where you are guilty until you're proven innocent. You're guilty until not only are you proven innocent, but somebody else is proven guilty. Also, yes. Luckily, I don't play these games for realism. Mm -hmm. The Reaper. That sounds horrifying. The Weeper. <laughs> well, that sounds horrifying. This might be the scariest prosecutor I've ever heard of so far. We've had Edgeworth, Von Karma's, plural... <laughs> Godot. One scarier than the other. <laughs> Blackwill. Nayuda. This guy seems terrifying. Mostly because his nickname. I don't remember the other characters having such a scary nickname. Blackwill might have had one, and I just don't remember what it is. But anyway. A living legend. I'm glad you said Nayuda. Even yeah. though I think he's the worst prosecutor. Uh, I would, fight, yeah. Fight, 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 <laughs> I agree. He's probably my least favorite of them all. I don't think bad, to be clear. He, not bad, just... I think he, his character arc is interesting. Like, as a character, he's fine. But as a rival, like, prosecutor... Not the best. Blackwell's up there. Mm -hmm. Edgeworth, of course. Sure. Um, Von Karma, just because he's horrifying. Well, and of course, Francisca's probably better than her pop. <laughs> well, she has a lot more long-term significance. Yes. Godot is fun, mostly because he throws coffee, and sure. his theme song is amusing. He throws coffee and drinks coffee. And drinks coffee, and he has a connection to one of the characters. Even though coffee's what betrayed him. Even though coffee is what betrayed him, yes, he still drinks the Loves shit out of it. <laughs> I mean, you know people who are coffee addicts. I mean, I kind of am one, so I get it. <laughs> and I completely have not been reading this conversation because now I've been thinking <laughs> about all of our other prosecutors. Well. <laughs> I, I know that this guy we're going up against is a legend, and no one who wants to go up against him, and blah, blah, blah. And this guy I thought he was going to have to defend himself, and... I don't I don't think you can recap the part you missed by saying something that's on the screen. Well, I mean, clearly that was the implication. He wanted us to just stand there, assuming yeah. that he was going to do it himself. I do like this prosecutor quite a bit. Okay. That's all I'll say for now. Hmm. It's you, boy. 
but a clone baby. <laughs> oh God! <laughs> no, no, it's not. No, no. Well, no. no. <laughs> nope. <laughs> Boy. All right, here we go. I look forward to seeing what this prosecutor's like gimmick is. Francisca had a whip, Godot had coffee. Black Will had handcuffs that he constantly broke out of. I don't remember what Nayuta's deal was, and Edric didn't really have a thing. I mean, he's got a couple of signature poses, but he didn't really have, like, a, it's not the same category as the ones you just mentioned. Yeah. Yes. Exactly. Like, you can imagine the different Edgeworth poses, but it didn't involve anything, you know, proppy. Yes, exactly. He didn't have any props to throw at us. Well... Oh my god, we have we have multiple witnesses. I am glad that this is something Look at that fire um, dot gif up there. It doesn't look great. <laughs> <laughs> <sighs> I'm glad that something from Professor Lane and Phoenix Wright stuck in well, a like mainline game. It's fun. Those uh while well, that did stick from those, those are not witnesses. Oh, is that the um Oh, is that the gallery? Interesting. I assumed that they were witnesses. I don't know why I would have thought that. Are our eyes freaking out, by the way? <laughs> oh, my God. There it is. Mm -hmm. <laughs> there it is. I missed it. <laughs> I'm really bug-eyed. What do you want from me? Oh, my God. What? Who's this vampire motherfucker? <laughs> this judge looks old. <laughs> Most of them are. <laughs> Though I like that both the Japanese judge and this one are not like buffoons. Yes. I thought the judges in the early games were a little too silly. They were kind of dumb sometimes. <laughs> yeah, a little dense and a little silly in equal parts. And mm -hmm. it was too much at times. Yeah, that's fair. <laughs> He's horrifying. <laughs> He's like a vampire. <laughs> I guess he's really leaning into his reaper imagery. <laughs> and I'm kind of I I'm here for it. I'm intrigued. <laughs> I don't know shit about fuck. <laughs> I just got here. I don't even know what this case is. My court record is embarrassing. <laughs> well, that's horrible. We've established what this guy's about in a couple lines of dialogue. How many tr cases are in this game? I've five. Five. Okay, I thought so, and I. And like in the second game, and in most games. Not Sweet. All. Not all, but pretty much. And it Ooh. takes us until the next case to get the full investigation slash trial experience, okay. which is, I don't know, fine, I guess. A little weird. Mm. Weird because it's been different throughout this game, or just... I just you didn't really get the full experience. Case one is just trial. Case two is just investigation. Case three is just trial. Mm-hmm. 
So it's more traditional then, in a sense. It's more like the old games where you got both, usually. Child doing in a murder trial. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and understandably wants to be in the park instead. Yeah, makes sense. It does seem like a place where a child would rather be. Well, it's as he said. This Reaper dude probably scared them all off. That guy's a knife. That's not allowed. <laughs> oh, these are this is like the jury. Mhm. Mm okay. So we have to convince the the jury. Interesting. She didn't even speak. He's an alcoholic. <laughs> Has a horseshoe mustache and an actual horseshoe. <laughs> all right. Well, you all seem very qualified and deeply invested. Hey, randomly chosen, you know? <laughs> Fair, yes. This is cool, though. I mean, it makes sense that... They would have a jury. Oh, it, it's a doozy. Oh boy. I'm sure it's gonna be some kind of gameplay mechanic or something or another. We're going to have to convince them, and if they're in a bad mood or something, we won't be able to convince them. And So we've been here for about, I think, two and a half hours, if you count the time that we supposedly waited in the Lord Chief Justice's office. Mm -hmm. We have no idea any details of the case. We don't really understand the juror system. We know of it, but <laughs> I've never experienced it. We're going up against some kind of legendary prosecutor. Mm -hmm. It's all going great. I think it's a good start. Wait, so if he hasn't done anything in a while, why is everyone so scared of him? Is it just because he's... People remember him being terrifying and they're like, well, we can't possibly... His reputation precedes His him. His reputation precedes him. There's the expression. I think the, the idea is that it's like more concerning that he came out of this supposed retirement. Oh, that makes sense. He's been gone for five years. What does he care about this case for? I don't, I, I'm out. I don't. I don't. Yeah, it is weird. He's a newbie like us. <laughs> Ever since he ran over that little girl with his truck. <laughs> He'll be rusty, right? Truck coon. <laughs> truck. All right, tell us what we got. I know it's a carriage murder, just from the opening um, title. But can the opening be trusted? But can the opening be trusted? And if it's Herlock, because last time you know, the opening talked about a snake, and the snake wasn't actually it wasn't a snake was, at all. There was a snake. There was a snake, but it but, was not the snake mm -hmm. in the story. So clearly, Herlock makes shit up. He dram dramatizes his story, and now I need to pay attention. Yeah. Incident, incident of glass. This is important. That's more so than usual because we have no idea what's <laughs> exactly. going on. Exactly. So I'm just going to take a second. Place in the late evening, three days ago. Hours, some minutes after 10 o'clock at night. Okay. 
the victor, the, vic the victor, the victim was a maker of building bricks. Yeah, he, he won something, all right. <laughs> known in the community as thrice fired Mason. Okay. Pretty cool. Destructible. <laughs> Won't let nobody break oh, me down. Oh, God. You want a knife in the chest. Oh, God. It's like more like in his stomach. Wow. Yeah. Okay. Wow. Corpse was discovered in an omnibus in service. <laughs> omnibus. <laughs> Dagger struck, thrust into the abdomen. Bleed being ultimate cause of death. It seems pretty deadly. All right, we're about to put something in the court record. It's about time. Oh, my God. Scotland Yard is helping, assisting. Kablam. Kablam. Oh, yeah, I need to be looking at these things out of habit Kaboom. because, like what we talked about before, sometimes it'll get stuck. His face is partially obscured by an old crooked hat. The hat's in on it, is it? <laughs> oh, like it's a scance. Oh, I understand. Okay. Fingerprintless gloves. Which doesn't really matter in this time period, but... Oh, there's blood. I didn't see that. It looked like part yeah, you, of just like the leather, you know? You might need to examine these, yeah. Yeah, I think I will. <laughs> It's hard to tell from here. I'm at like a angle on the TV. It's it's been consistently a problem. It is not the best. Well, that's incriminating. Look, we have Kazuma's sword. We're wearing it. <laughs> uh... Okay. Yeah, how did we get into this? Let me just take two seconds and this examine looks it. Terrible. Oh no, we got the armband from him too. That's what I was saying. <gasps> no. That's why it keeps falling down his arm. It's not oh, the right size. Oh, is that why? That's so cute. I did see that, and I was like, "Why did it move?" And now I get it, and that's really sad. I'm gonna go cry in a corner. Now, any of these, either text or photos, you can look at, so it's still good to do. Yes. But Typically, it's the objects that are going to require further inspection that might actually update the description of it. Fair enough. It doesn't always mean it's going to, but it can. Yes. Well, we're here, so deal with it. Yeah. You are going to be a defense lawyer. You're probably going to run into some murder cases. It's, it's going to happen, buddy. Oh, yeah. She's on top of it. But he was trying. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. All right. Let's flip him around. Take it around town. And I'm not really seeing anything else noteworthy. Yep. So it could just be that there's just there. Not everything yields further results. Oh, yeah. And I, I it would be a bit early for it to do that anyway, so... Yeah, it happens a lot. I'm not even done building the case yet. <laughs> Omnibus. <laughs> and the other was one McGilded. What is his name again? Hold on, let me. <laughs> Magnus McGill. I forgot his first name. I just completely blanked on it. Oh, the jury's gonna be biased. Oh, excuse me. I'm so tired. <laughs> uh. Um. Okay. <laughs> it's like you're being rocked like a baby in a cradle.
I gave him a hand and punched his stomach with my glove. <laughs> I mean, I'm sure he was, like, trying to stop the bleeding or something, but... <laughs> it's only the beginning. Oh, good. <laughs> <laughs> There's more? Oh, the slam. He's got the slam. Mm -hmm. And welcome to the jam. <laughs> well, that's incriminating, too. That lady is furiously typing. I'm very concerned. Order! Order! <laughs> Order! <laughs> I like his point. He's mm -hmm. just like, ugh, you. <laughs> He's like, oh shit, that's me. <laughs> and my defendant. <laughs> uh. All right, let's get these witnesses up in here. Okay. Oh, God, this guy's freezing Man who to is death. cold. Man looking away. Mm -hmm. Man with slippery hat. Excellent. Great. <laughs> Beppo. Beepo. Oh, he was. Oh, he was driving a different omnibus. Okay, got it, got it. Was he? Well, but yeah, if he said if he was the driver, he wouldn't have said I was the driver of the omnibus. Whatever, we'll get there. Banker, okay. First. Lady. Lady first. first? Late, like ladies first. Mm -hmm. Are you kidding me, dude? Oh my and god. He's not wearing a fedora. Dude, you gotta be wearing a fedora, man. Come mm. on. You have mm. one job in your miserable existence. Okay, it's fine. We're in an omnibus and witnessed witness to the aforementioned incident. Okay, so they were in a different omnibus. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Three Quite times. Quite right. Yes, sir. That's right, sir. Yeah, I, 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 I imagine uh, him with a nasally voice. Huh. Very nasally. The, the nasaliest voice you've ever heard. All right, let's get this cross examination up in here. All right. Okay. Add some gruesome. <laughs> His hat is giving me anxiety. <laughs> oh, he's got a whip too. Jesus. He's a von Karma. Beppo <laughs> van von Karma. Oh my god. <laughs> I fucking knew it. <laughs> this whip has been passed down the von Karma family line for generations. This hair's not gray, it's silver, just like <laughs> theirs. <laughs> I knew it. <laughs> I like how his eyes are still freaking out. <sighs> oh, it slipped again. I, I saw it better that time. That's so sad. <laughs> My heart is sad. Now, is it like the carriage we just rode in? Because it was open earlier. But it's okay. We're, we're newbies, so we, we don't know any better. We are... We are not cultured. We are uncultured swine. A whole series of dot, dot, dots. Oh, yeah.
yeah, I guess was the thing we wrote in earlier an omnibus? Or was that just a carriage? I don't know. I'm not even sure I know what it is. So I'm assuming the game will tell me. Yeah, we, we're, we're really new. Please don't be mad at us. We're trying our best. Oh, you're gonna you're gonna bring it here. <clears throat> kind of like um like five and six where they would like bring in stuff, not like props, but you know they would like there was the Greek school or whatever, and they brought in the statue or something. And five, um, I don't remember the details. He's so confused. <laughs> Bring in the carriage witness. 